Hello folks, thank you for joining me. This is uh, I, this is an unexpected video. I just uh, was actually checking out uh, something, a website that I said I would uh, help a friend uh, spread around. He had, he had sent me in my mailbox a prognatus septum and uh, he had sent this link out and I said okay yeah you know, spread it around to the people I know anyway, you know, not that there's a whole lot of you out there, but I do appreciate you faithful viewers, and uh, Lord bless you, and uh, so here's the link, and I'll put the link in the, this video as well, I did not know I was going to make a video about this until I started watching, and it's a good little site here, it's Awakened Video, you go to that link, it take you to this interesting page here that has all kinds of information uh, revealing, exposing this Sandy Hook hoax and ridiculousness and the whole um, I haven't watched all these videos yet I didn't even make it through the first video before I noticed something that I don't think I've heard anybody else mention everybody talks including the guy in this video <coughs> excuse me is talking about the little girl here how she holds her fingers and he goes on to show other pictures of her, how she's holding her fingers in her mouth like that with the little devil sign right there. But what nobody has mentioned or noticed, okay, is the doppelganger girl here. If you know, And then, of course, a lot of people say this photo is actually, this girl is always on the side, okay, the one that was supposed to be the victim. She's always like photoshopped in on the side of the photo. Um, and... A lot of people are saying, you know, especially since this girl showed up in the Obama photo with Obama wearing that dress, that it's actually the same girl. But I don't know about all that, and I'm not here to talk about that. What I am here to point out is, and I'm playing this, I'm on a closer shot here, that's what I'm waiting for. And I... Six six six. Uh, this guy, he just did the uh, Tomb Raider. If you're on Xbox, I actually did a post, just comment posting on my feed about the new Tomb Raider trailers were out for the new Tomb Raider game coming out March 5th, and I think it's that same guy that did that video. But anyway, that's irrelevant, really. I'm just throwing that in. But you know, six 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 on these coup cards. There's all kinds of. So let's, in a second, it'll go back to this photo. Hold on, right here. Now, okay, take away the, you take away this little dot, and he's showing the fingers, okay, and yeah, this girl seems, and look how intense her eyes are. That's how you can tell. I mean, she's obviously taken by a spirit. It's a spirit that's doing this, okay, uh, through these satanic people. But what I want to else point out is nobody notices. See this girl here? Look at her fingers down here. Everybody tries to say, oh, well, kids always suck their fingers. You know, well, okay, she's going to suck both the middle fingers all the time, every time. And in another photo, it's not even that her hand's backwards. It's she has her hand forward, facing palm out, and she's sucking her fingers backwards with the two other fingers sticking up. And I'll show you that in a minute. But what nobody notices is this obvious one right down here. He's blocking part of it with his pinky right there. But you can see this pinky is out. You can see the tip of the pinky right there coming out. And this finger is extended straight out. And the other two fingers are folded in. She is holding her hand in the devil horn sign as well. I've never heard anybody point that out. In fact, I haven't ever even noticed it in these photos. Not like I have spent any time really studying these photos. Um, I'm not really into this Sandy Hook thing. I know it was a hoax. It was a complete hoax. And uh, as far as all the policemen and all the media and all that, it was a drill put on by that same demonic cop. And obviously, and people that other people that haven't seen it, 
the the synagogue of Satan uh, is is based in this new town, Connecticut, as well. One of their chapters is is based out of this town. One of my old favorite movies. Uh, it's not that old, but it was done by the same guy that uh, did the uh, zombie flick. He did another movie called Hot Fuzz, and it was about a whole town that was into this witchcraft and Satanism and ceremony and ritual and anybody that didn't go along with their game they just killed and then they would frame it up as an accident and even the police chief was in on it right if you ever see if you haven't seen that movie go check it out it's actually a comedy but it is a it has a very pertinent and important message within that comedy and it's you know, here we're we're seeing it in real life. It, it's a town like that, and I actually know other towns like that myself from personal experience. And uh, I'm still dealing with those towns right now as we speak. But anyway, um, yeah, her little fingers are the same way. See, and she's holding it downward, and now he's holding his hand over her hand a bit. But when you, if you come to this link and you watch this video. You'll see it too. I'm going to play this video for a minute. It, since I don't have the sound set for the uh, computer, I got it set for my mic. You may not be able to hear the whole video. You may hear it in the background of my headphones here. But I have to play it and it will cut my voice down in volume a little bit. Yeah, there's a closer shot. She's holding the two middle fingers closed. There's the pinky finger sticking out. You can see, like I said, see the tip of the pinky finger right down here. And, and, bet and on the other side of his pinky finger. And then she's holding this finger straight out too. And uh, when I first saw it, I thought, is he holding her hand like that? But no, she's doing it. It's the little girl doing it. And then this girl there. And this guy does a good analysis of the finger thing. Now, I wish I could see her hand, this girl's hand here. And that's the doppelganger, like I said, and she's wearing the same dress that the other girl was wearing in that photo. This lady, it, that's her smile, the way she, you go back here and look at it too. That's a, this is a, supposed to be a smile, really? Is that what that is? You just squinch up your, your nose and you're like, hey, hey. it's like, hey. it looks like uh, almost, She'd be like the Pope's daughter there, but <laughs> I digress. I'm sorry. See now. Now in this video, he goes on to show you. And this is apparently a letter from LeVay. Of course, LeVay is dead now, but, uh, and, uh, it talks about Satanism, this and that, and it's signed on the letterhead, and this is what I was talking about earlier, and apparently he threw it in here. 
so that's good come watch this video come check out these uh, these videos in this website from Awaken Video and uh, like I said I'll leave the link in the box come check it out folks and uh, yeah I mean I'm telling you <laughs> the Illuminati the, the Illuminati are not humans okay folks they're not humans and the control mechanism the controllers are not even of this world or in this world they're behind the veil behind the think of the Wizard of Oz behind the curtain pay no attention to the man behind the curtain they say is behind the veil it's in the, like I, I did a one of my I pet goats I talked about the fourth dimension and the tetrahedron and the whole connection and how they control through the spirit and it's in the Bible too powers we, we don't Jesus said we don't fight against flesh and blood we fight against powers and principalities of darkness in high places okay this is all controlled through the spirit it's all coordinated through the spirit I mean think about it humans are not that smart they're not that coordinated they can't even you get a bunch of businessmen in a in a meeting room and they're uh, gonna spend all their time arguing with each other because most humans can't let their egos go they can't die to self and uh, you have to die to self to be able to truly see this stuff and just like uh, again refer to scripture um, just like you have to die to self to truly know the Lord and with that the Lord bless you all, and I hope you'll come check this out. Alright, thanks.